It is really anyone's guess now who will win the seat for New York State Attorney General. What is clear tonight is that there are two candidates in the race who are from Buffalo. Over the weekend, Democrat Licia Eve kicked off her campaign, and today, Republican Keith Wolford kicked off his campaign in Buffalo. But before he did that, he sat down for a one-on-one -on -one interview with our Claudine Ewing. Keith Wolford is a corporate New York City attorney who grew up on Winslow on Buffalo's east side, attended city honors in Harvard Law. Now, he's the state attorney general Republican nominee. We need to have real investigation into the pay-to-play system and we need to stop it. Right off the bat, he'll tell you. I'm not a politician at all, but we've gotten to a point in the state where there needs to be a change in business as usual. He didn't hesitate to use the word corruption. We need to tell those in the system and put them on notice that there's going to be real scrutiny and stopping the public corruption. We've had something like 42 indictments over the last 10 years of state officials. Yeah. You know, it, 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 you almost wonder whether Albany should just be broadcast on court TV. Uh, you can't help but think about the Buffalo Billion. The common sense tells us uh, the notion that there is a billion dollars that's actually come to Buffalo and been put on the ground to improve the livelihoods of people here is just not credible. Former A.G. Schneiderman resigned after reports he abused women. When it comes to politics now, morality is creeping into it. And how would you ensure people who would vote and you want their vote, they won't have that issue with you. There is a system that rewards people for going along to get along and to basically kowtow to political objectives rather than the substance of the job. Wolford hopes and heavily Democratic Erie that, County looks at qualifications. Regardless of power to party, the key element is that I am personally independent. I asked him about his donation to Democrats, including former President Obama. Will that fly with voters? Of course it will. I, like many other voters, look at the person and the possibility is what that person can do for the office. What are your thoughts on the Trump administration? The voters of New York, regardless of who the president is, need an attorney general who makes sure billions of dollars are not disappearing. And he vows complete independence from Governor Cuomo. I'm just not connected with any of the political firmament of the governor, whether it's the ones who have been indicted or the ones who have not. And outside the Central Library with his wife and children, Wolford kicked off his campaign. And you can see my entire interview with the endorsed Republican on WGRC.com this evening. Also in this race is another Western New York native, as you heard earlier, Democrat Licia Eve. The endorsed Democrat is New York City public advocate Letitia James. Claudine Ewing, Channel 2 News.